I think definitely what I valued the most about my CGS arts education has been the community. Um, every theater production that I've done from freshman year till now my senior year, I've just felt so supported and heard and validated by everyone in the casting crew. I remember coming into Catlin as a freshman and not really knowing anybody. I was new and I didn't really feel comfortable anywhere just yet. But as soon as I walked into the theater to do Macbeth, I did feel comfortable because I knew that there were people who were going to run lines with me who could give me rides home from rehearsal who would be able to laugh with me backstage. In the Catlin Gable Arts Department, students learn skills and methodologies and hone their craft while exploring new avenues and new ways to do things, all the while stretching their own ability to be creative and finding new avenues to self-discovery and finding ways to express themselves that they may not have had access to before. During my time in the Catlin Gable Arts Program, I've spent most of it doing performing theater and also theater tech. So I've really gotten to kind of see both sides of that. And I, what I really appreciate about it is just kind of the community that gets built up around theater, you know, both b backstage with, you know, working on stuff and building stuff and, you know, on the stage with running lines and doing performances and just the camaraderie that comes with all of that. We believe that the most impactful learning comes through the process of creation and the process of creating art and learning new things and that any products that result from this work are, be they finished podcasts or plays, concerts, a gallery show, that these are all fantastic byproducts that reflect the creative process undertaken to achieve them. And I really enjoy, you know, when I'm working in theater tech, I get to build something and then either you know, watch it be performed on by someone else or perform on it myself and just see how it kind of works in that setting. And it's really fun to try and read a script and interpret what the author was trying to say or what they wanted for specific different parts of it. And then, you know, either build something for that or to try and perform what they were meaning through their artwork. Catlin Gable's dedication to the arts is such that we are privileged to have a fantastic space at our disposal, the new Creative Arts Center. The middle school and upper school share this space, and it includes visual arts classrooms, music classrooms, drama classrooms, in addition to a digital music lab, a student gallery space, and a fully equipped black box theater. This is in addition to our existing ceramics and woodshop studios, our 3D art studio, and our larger proscenium theater space. We offer a wide variety of courses for students to choose from. They're ever evolving, responding to student interest and instructor passion. And they encompass, although are not limited to, such things as uh, ceramics, painting, podcasting, digital media arts, theater tech, improvisational theater, rock band, choir, and an ever-evolving slate of possibilities. And students have the opportunity to showcase their work throughout the year in a variety of concerts, plays, gallery shows, and sometimes off-campus gigs as well. Theater was the first place in Catlin that I felt really like I belonged. And I feel like that is so true of the arts community at Catlin, whether that's through music, art, dance, theater. It really is a place for everybody.